This is also kind of interesting. So this this is from CBSSports.com. Uh, NFL Christmas wish list, the perfect gift for each and every team. For the Browns, they give them a bag of coal. They've been the opposite of nice in the way they've handled the Deshaun Watson situation this year, especially after they seem to have found a bit of a groove with Jacoby Brissett at the start, overtime win against Tom Brady and the Buccaneers. That's a little harsh. I mean, somebody... Somebody like um, somebody did something in the Wheaties of somebody over at CBSSports.com over there. That's bag of coal is a little aggressive uh, on the negative side there. Well, especially when it said it's the perfect gift. I, it, it took a, a left turn there that I didn't see coming when I read that article. Yeah, a li- it's a little bit. It's like I love Jacoby Brissett. I think what he did, it was awesome. He played way better here in this system with Kevin Stefanski than he had played in his career anywhere else, which I think is another reason why Stefanski deserves praise and deserves, uh, I, uh, you know, the another year. I'm not sure with the way they handled the Deshaun Watson situation, how they could have handled it any better, uh, so to speak. Like, I understand, you know, once he was brought in and what happened and all the off the field stuff, I just don't know what exactly it was that they should have done differently that anybody was going to be di- do differently other than not get involved if you just didn't if you think that they shouldn't have gone that direction. But yeah, they had some momentum going, but you know, it's it you go all in. With Deshaun Watson, you trade multiple first-round picks. You give him the highest guaranteed contract ever. It just would not make any sense to not play him as soon as you possibly can, especially if you're trying to go all in in 2023. Yeah, I mean, he's your franchise quarterback. Jacoby Brissett did a great job, but he's not a franchise quarterback. He'll earn a nice – I would assume he's going to be a nice bridge contract kind of guy next year. You know, the, the Jets would kill to have him right now. You talk about a team that wishes Jacoby Brissett could suit up for him, but I digress. Um, but, yeah, you go to your franchise guy. This is the guy you're expecting to be your quarterback the next 10, 12 years. So I, I, don't, I don't get it. 